Standing just 5 feet 11 inches tall, many said Bowen Bourne was too small to play Division I basketball. Ben Jacobson and the UNI Panthers did not care. And now Bourne is proving the doubters wrong. Mark Freund has more on Bowen Bourne. We've met Bowen Bourne, the artist. Art is definitely something that's, um, that's pretty cool and a little bit different. We've met Bowen Bourne, the prom date. We got uh, you know, to experience a lot of the same things we would have experienced you know, if we went to normal prom. But who is Bowen Bourne now? Overall, I'm just a super hard worker um, you know, in, in everything that I do. Work, pivotal in helping Bourne chase down that state championship at Norwalk. <laughs> Work that earned him a spot at UNI. Throughout the recruiting process, UNI was always the school that uh, put in a ton of time with me. And it was just that culture that he had seen at Norwalk was something that I think he felt like, I want to be a part of that at, at Northern Iowa as well. The real work started and Bourne responded. Love this kid. Bowen Bourne. With the Missouri Valley Freshman of the Year Award. Bowen Bourne. Bowen needed to do a lot for us as a true freshman. There was a big improvement there. Followed by an MVC Sixth Man of the Year honor. Deep three. Last season. <laughs> Being thrown out there my freshman year, it was it was a lot, and um, you know having played two more years after that, I've I've learned the game a lot more. But the job was about to get bigger. We were losing guys. This was going to be the first year that the team was really different um, than my first two years, just in terms of of, of film um, and workouts and um, working out consistently and and um, amounts of shots I was putting up. Like I've never worked harder than I have like this past summer. Um, and it is to have a season like I'm having right now. Whenever you work really hard at something, you want to see results. That would attribute, yeah, to, to the work that I put in this summer. In year three, the scoring has shot up. Born at 19 points per game on February 1st. He's got 12 games of 20 or more points and one 30 point blitz against Drake. <laughs> that included two <laughs> buzzer beaters. Born is the breakout star of the Valley. You know, it's always just about staying consistent, and um, I knew that I was good enough, and I think that was. What was really important is just the belief that I had in myself. He works so hard. He, he's never satisfied with where he's at. He's always wanting to get better. He works just tirelessly on his game. He thrives on that, that it is hard, okay? Just tell me how much time I got to put in. Well, it's going to take what it's going to take, and he's, he's that guy. But not all has been smooth. UNI has lost seven of eight, a stretch that has seen Bourne's scoring average drop nearly two full points to 17.4 per game. You can work and work and work for years, and you can still have a game where you play terribly. But like any good teammate, it's we before me. Bowen has experienced a regular season Valley Championship with UNI, but now there's more out there. It's also the goal of, of playing in March Madness, you know, that's something that, that we want to do, that, that everybody wants to do. It's a tremendous combination to, to have, um, you know, his ability to go and get 20 and have everybody in our program know that all he wants is for our team to play well. The work continues, but Bowen is born for it. To say I'm the leader on a Division One basketball team, like this is something that as a kid would have baffled me. In Cedar Falls. You know, I'm just super thankful for Mark Freund. The options that Northern Iowa has given me. WHO 13 Sports. Uh, just a nice young man from a terrific family and one of those not surprising lessons that, hey, what do you know? He works really nice. hard at it. Wow. Put in the work. Great lesson. Got to believe in yourself first and then put in the work. Put in the work.